Hey there. Well, I just got done watching South Park Not Suitable for Children. It is absolutely filled with plays on words, especially where sometimes what the character is saying is supposed to be taken the right way in, in the scenario they're in, and then sometimes it's supposed to be taken the wrong way. And uh, they, they switch it around all over the place, and it's, it's quite, quite humorous. It heavily focuses on some of the problems with being a social media influencer of some sort. It, it, only fans and such, right? Uh, social media in general. Marketing. And so many things that unfortunately get pushed onto kids, even though technically they're supposed to be for adults. I can picture some person in marketing now saying, wink, wink, nudge, nudge, say no more, right? In a scene where influencers are being auctioned off, the buyers ranged from the pharmaceutical industry to the Chinese government, to stole vodka, to the NRA. There were quite a few more, and I hope I haven't given away too much with my description of that scene. There are definitely some very, very key things that I left out of my description of that scene, so hopefully this isn't a spoiler. The thing that I just simply did not expect visually was the nudity, especially the focus on dicks. I mean, I expected a lot of swearing, you know, adult subject matter, but not the nudity, and not the way that they utilized it. I just didn't expect them to utilize it that way, and it, it was so cringy at times, and in a very entertaining way, for sure. So much hilarious cringe. The writers of South Park are amazing. They're more on top of what's really happening than any other mainstream piece of entertainment I can think of. I'm actually very thankful for them. So I laughed, I cringed, I sometimes turned away out of a reflex. Yeah, there's so much going on. It's quite provocative in ways that only South Park could really pull off at this time. I had a great time. As long as you're an adult, I highly recommend it. I'd give this a 9 out of 10.